The Most Expensive Yacht in the World Owning a super fast car might put you in the limelight of being called rich, but owning a super yacht will definitely draw the public attention to you that a new billionaire is in town. Yachts owners are in the league of their own, and only top billionaires can dare to own one of these cruising modes of transportation. Hey everyone, welcome to your favorite luxury channel, and in today's video we will be discussing the most expensive yachts in the world. So, without further ado, let's get into it. There are lots of yachts in the world, but the mega yachts or super yachts that measure more than 50 feet are considered worthy, so we compiled a list for you to get familiar with yachts only billionaires can afford. The Dilbar yacht owned by Alisher Uzamnov is a beauty to behold, and while some review websites name it the largest yacht in the world in terms of gross tonnage and interior volume, some tagged it the fourth largest yacht in the world. Designed to be a jaw-dropping yacht, you can't see the yacht on any harbor and not stare for a couple of minutes. It's a complete embodiment of beauty and luxury. Dilbar is a fully run by 80 crew who help maintain the yacht and to attend to the guests' needs. In some cases, when Alisher wants to host a party, the crew members can be increased, which shows the yacht can accommodate up to 120 people plus the guests. Dilbar interior contributes largely to its beauty and price tag, and if you're a designer, you can't help but be amazed at the perfect work of Andrew Winch, who took all his time to keep Dilbar an elegant and sleek look. The classical interior is made of natural wood and leather to give a feeling of nature and freshness. We all love nature, and being on the Dilbar is such a sure way of getting to know what nature smells like. Some of the rooms in Dilbar are made with dark woods, while some are made with colored wood to give it a synthetic coating against insects that could damage it, and also to beautify the super yacht. In addition to the love of nature on the yacht, Dilbar is fully decorated with a garden full of flowers and grasses that are tolerant to almost all extreme weathers and conditions. So, when cruising on seas that contain high salt levels, the grasses and flowers won't die off. German architect and founder of Yacht Green Axel Masmann, who designed the garden, said he carefully chose plants from the Mediterranean because Dilbert tends to be between the south of France, northern Spain, and sometimes Cyprus. Dilbert's flagship includes a beam of 23 meter and a 6 meter draft to give it a solid look. The lighting on the Dilbar features 1,100 kilometers of cables from the ground to the top floor to give it a blazing night look and to be the perfect replica of a sun reflection on all floors. Dubai, 400 million. There is something common amongst the Arab nations and that is that they all love luxury lifestyles. And the Dubai yacht is proof of this assertion. You can't take luxury away from the Arabians, it's a part of them. Dubai Mega Yacht was constructed by Platinum Yachts for the Prince of Brunei and now it's owned by the ruling Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum of Dubai. The 524-foot yacht took 10 years to perfect and is widely considered one of the most luxurious yachts in the world. Dubai boasts a mosaic tile swimming pool, multiple jacuzzis, and disco squash court. It is equipped with all high-tech gadgetry and uber-luxurious amenities expected from a vessel of its kind. Its dining room alone can hold up to 90 guests and the boat has room for 88 crew members and support staff. Her features really approve her status of the most luxurious yacht. The seven-decked yacht has an impressive 70-foot wide atrium landing pad for a Black Hawk helicopter, some marine garage, cinema, stunning circular staircase with glass steps that change color the light that enters from the top deck. Topaz, 527 million. Topaz is one of the greatest luxury kings of the ocean with a length of over 482 feet. Topaz is amongst the largest private luxury yachts in the world, and it's owned by billionaire Mansour bin Zayed Al Nayyan, Deputy Prime Minister of the United Arab Emirates and member of the Abu Dhabi royal family. For the football fans, billionaire Mansour bin Zayed Al Nayyan also owns Manchester City Football Club. Topaz features eight gorgeous decks for different exotic viewing experiences. Its salient features include lifts, a swimming pool, two jacuzzis, helipads, a conference room, and a movie theater. The yacht can accommodate up to 62 guests with 26 cabins on board, along with 79 crew members. The mega yacht also has stabilizers to ensure comfort on board when the yacht is at an anchor particularly in rough water. Just like the previous yacht owned by a royal family, very little is known about the Topaz to keep the royal family safe. Azam, 630 million. Built in 2013, Azam made history for not only its size but its ability to reach top speed of more than 30 knots. Azam's design focused on maximizing interior space and having very minimal exterior features. The ship's decks are closed with sealed platforms. 
The sun deck is also covered in glass. The reason for this is to offer guests maximum privacy on board. Due to extreme privacy, only a movie theater, two helipads on the ship's bow, and lounging space on the main deck are the only features that are visible from the exterior. The interior remains undisclosed since it belongs to the royal family member Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed Al Nayyan, President of the United Arab Emirates and Emir of Abu Dhabi. Azam is known to have a sophisticated interior that offers maximum comfort. Azam can also accommodate 36 guests and 60 crew members, which isn't a surprise for a yacht of her size. Measuring 590 feet long, this floating beauty boasts the largest private yacht in the world, knocking the eclipse of the first spot. Verify reports also have that the Azam has its very own missile defense system as well as a bulletproof master suite. Streets of Monaco, 1.1 billion. The first billion dollar yacht in this video. The 509 foot Streets of Monaco is a serious project that features a floating replica of the city of Monaco, or to be more precise, a scaled down version of a section of Monte Carlo, similarly to the real thing. The Streets of Monaco boast smaller reproductions of the city and most famous landmarks, including Café de Paris, Hotel de Paris, and the famous Monte Carlo Casino and Monaco Grand Prix inspired go kart track. The giant yacht requires a crew of 70 some of whom will be tasked with maintaining the oasis, a space at the rear of the ship that serves as a main boarding and entertaining area. The yacht features swimming pools and tennis courts, some mini submarine extra large helipads as well as a mini waterfall and a cafe bar with underwater views. The Eclipse 1.5 billion Seems football club owners are competing with each other in the yachting world. The luxury super yacht Eclipse is the second biggest and the most expensive privately owned vessel in the world. The 533.1 foot yacht took five years to build, and it was delivered to no one but Chelsea football club owner Roman Abramovich. The Eclipse immense size provides space for the boats. Many extravagant features including 24 guest cabins, two swimming pools, two helicopter pads, three launch boats, and a mini submarine. The Eclipse also features a private defense system including missiles, detection sensors, intruder alarm, and armor plating, and bulletproof windows in his master bedroom. The yacht also features an anti-paparazzi shield which consists of lasers sweeping the surrounding area. The Eclipse yacht can house approximately 36 guests and 70 crew members. History Supreme 4.8 Billion For every record set in the luxury world, a well-known billionaire will always set forth to break the record and reset it. History Supreme has broken the record as far as comfort and price are concerned. Made of solid gold, the History Supreme is the most expensive yacht in the world and it's reportedly owned by Malaysia's richest man, Robert Kuwak. This gorgeous 100-foot vessel was designed by the world-renowned UK luxury designer Stuart Hughes and reportedly took three years to complete this massive work of art. About 100,000 kilograms of solid platinum and gold were used to construct it, and it's said that the interior is more impressive than the most five-star hotels. The deck, rail, staircase, anchor, and dining areas are all coated with solid gold. The most extravagant aspect of this luxury yacht is its master bedroom that has a wall made from meteorite rock and a statue made from genuine T-Rex bones. The owner's suite is adorned with a 68 kilogram, 24 karat gold Aqua Vista panoramic wall aquarium. On board, there is also an iPhone encased in 500 diamonds with 7.4 and 8 karat diamonds fitted over the home button. It's insane. There you have it all guys, let us know your thoughts about the video in the comment section. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and smash the notification button to get notified whenever we release a new video. I'll see you all in the next one.